Henry calling. Badge 1317. What's that address? Wait a minute, I'll write it down. 1708 Elko. Name is Carney. Yeah. Neighbors are worried, huh? Okay, I'll check it. 1708, that's the old widow's place. I'll get right over there. Why, Mrs. Carney, your neighbors have been worried. You haven't been outside since you got back from the hospital. And they phoned the district station, and I was notified to, to check up and see that you were all right. They shouldn't have bothered you. There's nothing you can do about it. About what, Mrs. Carney? About me. I'm tired and I'm ill. However, I've paid for my room. I'm not troubling anyone. Oh, I, I know that. and. I sure don't mean to interfere, ma'am. But I did get the call, and, and if you're sick, I, I could get an ambulance for I'm you. I'm not going back to the hospital. I'm staying right here in my room. I... Easy now, ma'am. Oh. Say, you are sick. I'm not going to leave here. Mrs. Carney, if you don't want an ambulance, won't you let me call social service at City Hospital? They can send a visiting nurse to see you. A visiting nurse? I, I don't understand. They're paid through the community chest. I won't take charity. Well, you can pay what you're able. But, you know, as long as I've been around this neighborhood, I've, I've heard about your doing nice things for people. Maybe it's time someone did something for you. But I have no family. No one who really cares. Oh, Mrs. Carney, there are a lot of folks who care. The people who give one day's pay to the community chest. They put up that money to help folks just like you here in our own hometown. And I know what those dollars do, because I see it most every day. There's a man I help across the street. He's on his way home from Industrial Aid for the Blind. He, he lost his sight some years ago, but thanks to this chest agency, he's still able to earn most of his living. It's wonderful what fine work those sightless folks can do. And there's my own sister, Amelia. Every weekday of the world, she takes my nephew, Jimmy, to the Stella Morris Day Nursery out on Union. Amelia's a, a widow. She has to work, and if it wasn't for the day nursery, she'd have no place where she could leave the boy. It's a fine place for youngsters. Games and refreshments, and they learn how to get along with other kids. Yes, sir, that's a community chest agency that means a lot to a lot of young mothers. You know, a policeman is called upon to do all kinds of things, and I guess that's why he knows what the community chest means to St. Louis. I remember a man who was hurt in an accident, and I helped get him to the hospital. His right arm was paralyzed. He didn't have much hope of ever working again. That is, not until he was transferred to the Miriam Hospital out in Webster Groves. Out there, they have ways of helping people to, to get their strength back so as they can use their legs and arms. The men and women who come there are sometimes crippled and helpless. And when they leave, they're ready to return to active lives. Well, I figure that work like that is worth an awful lot to St. Louis. The community chest dollars are a mighty fine investment for everybody. You know, Mrs. Carney, a few years ago, there was a lot of talk about gangs and kids running wild. And I just wonder if people know the other side of the story. I used to see it every day at the YMCA Youth Center out on Page Boulevard. That's a place where boys and men can meet and have a good time, and while they're at it, learn something about being good citizens. Oh, they all pay dues, but still, without some help from the chest, the place would have to close down, and where would those boys go then? For that matter, where would a, a lot of people go if it weren't for some of the agencies supported by your community chest dollars? 
The servicemen who are coming here and asking us, where can we go? They're just in town for a few hours between trains or for a weekend pass. Now, thanks to the success of last year's community chess campaign, we can send them to the USO at Soldiers Memorial, a place to clean up and get passes for movies and ball games and just relax. We certainly wouldn't be fair to the boys in service if we didn't maintain places like these. Yes, sir, where would people turn if it weren't for the Red Feather agencies? Sometimes they find homes for, for babies whose own parents can't care for them. That means a new life for the youngster and a new kind of happiness for the parents who give her that foster home until their own folks can take over. And sometimes that red feather means a, a decent last few years for an old person with nowhere else to go, a chance to live in peace and dignity. Like I said, Mrs. Carney, there are a lot of people who care about their neighbors, who want to help them and do help them by giving one day's pay to the community chest each year. You've always been one of those people, haven't you? Why, yes. I always gave as much as I was able to. It seemed only right. It was right. I know because day in and day out, I see what those dollars buy. Officer Henry. I'm so glad you came to see me. I guess here in my room alone, I'd forgotten that in this country, in this city, people do care about each other. I guess you, you never really know how much the community chest can mean until you need it. You who give one day's pay, to the Greater St. Louis Community Chest will walk with that visiting nurse. You'll be with her not only when she comes to care for me, but in all the homes where she's truly an angel of mercy, bringing special skill and care to those who need it. You'll give youngsters sunshine and fresh air at summer camps. You give the blind and the handicapped a chance at employment and a real right to the self-respect that comes with self-support. You make old age an easier time for many folks and give youth a, a sense of really belonging to the community. You find homes for homeless infants and extend a welcome to servicemen who are a long way from their own towns. Yes, we who come to need the community chest agencies learn that they're always on call, that the services they perform are, are worth far, far more than what they cost. We know that you do give best through community chest. So please, give the best you can. Mm -hmm. 